एंड वॉट इज अप गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल हैप्पी न्यू ईयर टू ऑल माई सब्सक्राइबर एंड आई विश योर दिस ईयर गोज वेरी वेल एंड यू विल अचीव ऑल योर ड्रीम्स इन दिस ईयर सो एज यू गाइज नो दैट मार्वल राइवल्स हैज बीन लॉन्च रिसेंटली एंड इट इज गेनिंग अज पॉपुलरिटी अमॉन्ग ऑडियंसिस एंड गेमर्स एंड आई नो यू गाइज वॉन्ट मार्वल राइवल थ्री डी मॉडल बट गेटिंग इट इज क्वाइट डिफिकल्ट सो आई डिसाइडेड टू मेक अ टूटोरियल ऑन एफ मॉडल Uh, on how to extract uh, marvel rivals models using f model so you guys might uh, have known or you might know that f model is a free application that help us to extract 3d model for from video game and i have made a tutorial on valorant i thought why not make a tutorial on uh, marvel rivals let's start with the tutorial so first you need to download f model and f model can be easily downloaded you just need to google f model uh, and you can download the f model and make sure to join their discord because in their discord you can find a huge community which will help you uh, while texturing and uh, making animations in model okay so let's start with extracting mod so as you guys can see that i have already installed f model so just double click on this application and while uh, opening it you can see a directory selector option has appeared so here we need to specify our down game download locations so just click on uh, steam and go to your game libraries here in marvel rivals go to the setting options and then go to manage and then click on browse local files and just copy this location the above location just uh, uh, click on it and press control plus c so we have copied this and now close this folder now again go to your f model and here in directory option here here you can see there are three dots available just click on this and paste this file location here okay now in here just click on this marvel game then go to marvel then go to content and then go to packs and here you can see it's nothing so we don't need to go further just click on the select folder okay so you can see that it has already detected everything but it is detecting wrong now click on this ue version ue version and here we need to search m a r marvel okay so it has uh, when you type marvel you can see that game marvel rivals has appeared and it says game ue 5.3 so marvel rival is made on unreal engine 5.3 okay so just select it and press okay okay so here you can see that it has uh, loaded all the pack files but we cannot open this pack files because you can see every pack file has a red dot uh, uh, appeared on it means we have not decoded it it's in encrypted form and we can't see the content inside those files so first we need to add aes key to unlock these files and how will you do that just click on directory and then you can see here is an option for selecting aes key just click on it and you can see that there are five to six option where you need to add your aes key to unlock this file so i will be giving this aes key in youtube description you can just copy uh, the those aes key and paste them here so i will tell you how to do that first we need to add the main static key which is this one and this will be provided in youtube description just copy this and paste it in the first one now you can see that there are four other pack chunks we need to add those keys so we have all those keys just copy those keys and add those keys so you can see that i have copied the first one so uh, i will paste it into the first one next the second one once you have done this step uh, just uh, click on ok button and you can see that every other file every those pack files will turn into green now you can view the content inside it and these are the file in which most of the game assets are available so once every files has turned green just click on the load button and it will take some time like 2 to 3 second and you can see that whole the game folder has been loaded now before doing anything here first of all we need to add our mappings file otherwise our 3d model that are exported will be broken and some model might not be able to export properly okay so download the mapping files from the description it is 700 to 800 kb file uh, and a very uh, light file you need to download that file and just add that into your f model so for adding that just click on this setting button and in general setting you can see here is a option for local mapping file just click on this this button enable and then just uh, specify that path where you have downloaded the mapping file so i have downloaded in uh, into that our in desktop folder just click on desktop you can see here is my mapping file just click on this and press open button and i don't think here you need to change any other setting just press on okay so we have already added our mapping files now we are ready to export anything that we want okay 
so here where you can find 3d model uh, of character so click on this marvel drop down menu and uh, it for you it might appear like this just press on this content drop down menu and then click on this marvel drop down menu again and then click on this characters so as you can see that here in this character folder all the characters that are available in marvel rivals game are provided but they are in decoded form and uh, a guy on discord has discoded, uh, decoded them so i will provide that txt file where you can see the every character coded name uh, and their uh, original name okay so i will provide that in description but if you don't want to download that uh, there is no problem you can basically preview every character in f model only you don't need to open blender and then import that model and then preview that model you can preview every character with textures in f model only so let's start with the 1034 okay 1034 here are the other four or three variants of that same model because they are our skins in game and the first one is i think the default one and there are different skins so let's start with the first one so just click on this drop down and in meshes you can find all the 3d basically the model the mesh of the 3d uh, character okay so just double click on this message because there is no drop down menu here we can't further go beyond this so we just need to go in this folder so just double click on this folder and you can find many other different assets here like 7 to 8, 7 to 8 assets so you here you need to remember we can't preview the physics asset and the skeleton asset we can only preview this lobby asset and the other one the u asset one okay we, we also can't preview the physics data set and also sksl lobby so we can preview the lobby ones and the u uh, basically this one the default one okay so we we will not preview right now the lobby one we will preview this one so just double for previewing just double click on this mesh and wait for some time and you can see that this is the uh, mesh of iron man and we are previewing it with textures all the textures if you click on the here you can see all the textures that are used are uh, the name of those textures are provided below okay and the material used in, in this 3d model are here equip one head one body one equip one equip four okay and the texture related to that material are listed here okay so you can see that we are previewing iron man so this is the mesh of iron man okay and uh, if you double click on this lobby asset it will preview the iron man asset that is used in lobby because lobby ones are different from that asset that you are using in actual gameplay okay so the gameplay ones are lighter uh, in compared to the lobby ones okay so lobby ones are heavier so i don't recommend it to preview but if you have good pc you can preview them if you don't have good pc you can directly export them model and then preview it in blender because that will be good f model is not made for previewing model but more like exporting the 3d model and exporting materials okay so this is how you preview in f model suppose you want to preview his other skins so let's try the 500 one or 800 one and then go to double click on this meshes and you, ca you can see here are also some different assets, uh, assets just click on this one and wait for some time and you can see it's a different version of Iron Man okay you can also use this and uh, suppose we want to preview 500 one ones so just double click on this meshes and then this one double click on this okay so the see here is a silver thing of iron man i don't know i think it's war machine maybe maybe, maybe i have no idea so this is how you preview the models in marvel rivals you can preview any other model let's try with 1048 so the first one is always the default one and the other two are basically their skins or their variants so just click on the first one then double click on this message and preview this one okay and wait for some time you can see that it's i don't know what character is this uh, so you can see this character you can preview it okay so how do you export this model because we are previewing this in f model how do we export exactly export in f model okay so exporting is very easy support you want suppose you want to export this model just right click on it and you can see here are many different options available just click on the save model you can see here you can see that save model option is there just click on it and wait for some time it might take some time for slower pc but for faster pc it will take uh, i think 20 to 30 seconds okay okay you can see that the model has been exported and how do you know the model has, has been exported when here you can see a completed option has been available which means that our model has been exported and where did it went so you can see here it says successfully saved in lod 0 pskx sk so just click on this and it will take you to the location where your 3d model has been saved you can see that my 3d model has been saved here but how do you open this model in blender you need to install a plugin in blender and the plugin name is P psk psa importer i will provide that plugin in 
description you you need to install that plugin in blender and then you can import this model so i am telling you how to import that model so as you guys can see that we have already opened the blender and for now we are using blender 4.2 you can use some advanced version also but blender 4.0 is fine i think so first of all you need to download this plugin io import scene you unreal psk psk 401 okay there are also other variants like 280 or 200 so that that are older version and if you install that plugin uh, your marvel rival model might not be exported in blender because they will get broken some meshes will be missing and some bones will be broken so it's better to use the latest one and i will provide this in description okay uh, and also the original website where this has been uploaded and it's completely safe to use it has no virus i can guarantee that so just click on this blender and just delete everything here click on edit okay to preferences then click on add-ons and then click on this install button and go to the place where you have uh, downloaded this uh, uh, plugin so just select this plugin and click on install add-on and make sure to enable this plugin make sure the uh, checkbox here is selected okay then click on here and then go to save preferences now close the uh, uh, pop-up menu now you can see we have installed the psk 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 psa plugin if you go to file import here you can see that there is an option for uh, importing skeleton mesh psk and skeleton anim psa okay so we need to import this psk okay so first of all let's go where we have uh, exported our model so just uh, uh, open your app model and click on this button you can see we have exported our model here just copy this location okay then go to blender then click on file then click on import and then click on this psk one and paste that location here and then select this model and press import psk and wait for some time and do not do anything on uh, uh, during this process okay you, otherwise your blender might crash okay so you can see that i have uh, imported our uh, uh 3d model and here you can see that the it's the same model with all the bones available and also the materials are also available here if you select the mesh and click on this material setting option you can see all the materials are available here so this is how you export model using f model okay and you can see that the smoothing has been turned on uh, this model so for disabling that just go to this data settings and then click on normals and turn off auto smooth you can see no models have become instantly detailed so earlier and now earlier and now if you want you can use auto smooth but i don't use that because these are already optimized 3d model okay so this is how you import 3d model in blender so in next video i will tell you how to texture these model because texturing is a completely different process and it might take some time to tell how to export these uh, how to texture these models okay if you know texturing you can start texturing this model because it has not export it has not been exported with textures and it's good thing you can manually export those textures and then apply them as you want okay so this is how you uh, do uh, export the models through f model so guys i hope you liked the video and make sure to subscribe my channel and if you subscribe i will uh, you will get the notification of the next video uh, to about texturing this model so i hope your new year goes perfect and see you in next video in which I will tell you how to texture this mod. Thank you guys.